Hello everyone, Neil from Merchant Former here. Today I want to go over our new listing optimizer module, which is going to help you with your on-page SEO to, to essentially get your listings seen higher up in Amazon for different keywords, as well as help you write your product descriptions and product features. So the first thing you're going to want to do is come over to the left hand side here where you'll see at the very bottom listing optimizer. It's broken into two pieces, listing score checker and our synonym suggest module. So first let's head over to the listing score checker. What you'll see here is a little search box that's going to ask for an ASIN as well as some keywords. So you can see on the right hand side here you can add different keywords. In order to be able to use this module, you're first going to want to have a t-shirt that is up. Possibly you have one up, it's not selling as well as you'd like it to, and you would like to essentially see how well that listing is optimized. So what we've done is I've just pulled up a random shirt here. As you can see, it's called uh, Tacos E-Texas. You're going to want to scroll down until you see the product description box right here, and what you're looking for is this ASIN number. So you're going to want to copy that. Bring that over here, paste it right into Merchant Former. For some keywords, let's just keep it simple. Texas and tacos, and hit search. As you can see, it's pretty quick. It'll bring up a quick analysis screen right here where you can see the keywords and phrase. Now, these are not the greatest of keywords. I just put these in for example purposes. You'll see if these keywords are found in the title, if they're found in the brand name, if they're found in the features, the description, and then we check to see if the description is over a thousand characters. Now from our experience, the title, brand, features, and description are super important to be able to be seen in the search results. So you definitely want to make sure that the keywords that you're targeting are included in each of those spaces. You don't want to just be spamming keywords, but instead you want to be writing coherent sentences that make sense. The description is not going to be is isn't really something that we found that makes much sense for ranking purposes, but for mobile and to be shown in Google results, this is extremely important. So we make sure to check that and we give you a little optimization percentage here. Now in order to make sure that your product descriptions and your product features are having some great keywords in them, Something I recommend to do is to look up different synonyms to add in to your descriptions to make sure that you are talking about something relevant, but you are also adding other keywords. So if you go over here to the listing optimizer and click on the synonym suggest, it'll pop up this screen. As you can see, I've searched for one keyword here. You're going to want to enter in some keywords that you were using. So for example, back on this uh, t-shirt right here about tacos, perhaps we want to search for Texas if I can spell that correctly, Texas, eat, and food. You either want to make sure these are separated by a space or by enter. It will not work if you use commas. So once you have the keywords entered, simply hit search. And down here you'll see the synonyms for Texas, eat, and food. We have a nouns column, an adjectives column, and a verbs column. As you'll see here, the results that are shown are only those that are found for synonyms. So you can come here and say you're looking at food, say you're looking at eat, maybe you want to eat, uh, consume might be a word. So you can click on the word. You can either send it over to the product search module, which will bring up shirts that are selling for that keyword based on BSR. You can throw it in our keyword finder, which will bring up all the auto suggest keywords for that term consume or you can throw it in the listing optimizer which is what we just went over previously if you are putting a bunch of shirts online in one session and you're trying to think of different keywords to put in instead of spamming the same keywords over and over again it's going to be really beneficial to use the synonym suggest tool that we put right here not only is it going to make your listings look a lot better but for your audience you're going to be they're going to be able to find your products a lot faster because they're going to be ranked a lot higher for the keywords that you have put in.